Uh, so many. So little time. Let's do it. Paralog 72. Hey, it's almost time for the Bridal's Festival. Aren't you going to get ready for the tournament? How am I supposed to fight in something that formal? I prefer clothes that I can move around in. The rules don't require us to wear anything specific, so why do I see so many frilly outfits like yours? Well, I guess most girls want to feel pretty on their big day. Appearances are important too, you know. The people of the plains have always preferred practical attire. I'm still not sure about all this gaudiness. Cecilia, Cecilia, do you, do you hear? What's wrong, Lelina? Slow down and take a deep breath. The prize for the Bridal Festival's tournament has been announced. It's, it's a special ceremony, but only if you find a bridal bouquet and best everyone else covet, right? Yes, and Roy is going to be the last one standing. I just know it. That means they'll have to choose someone to join him for the ceremony. Ah, so that's what's driven you into such a tizzy. And to make matters worse, rumor has it that he's already has his eye on someone. Who could it be? We've known each other for so long, but we've never talked about this sort of thing. If you're that concerned about it, why not win the bouquet yourself? Huh? The victor can ask anyone they wish to accompany them, right? So win and ask him yourself. At the very least, you won't have to fret about him asking someone else. That said, please remember that even if he does accept, this festival is just for fun. Yes, of course. Oh, Cecilia, you're the best teacher I could ever ask for. Thank you. Just watch. I'm going to win this tournament no matter what. A twist here, a twist there, and a final flourish to top it all off. Alright, my dancing's never looked any better. I'm going to get that bouquet and make Lord Roy my partner in the victory celebration. You're certainly high spirits. It seems Lelina has some competition. Are you after Roy too, Sophia? I'm happy just to have worn such a pretty outfit. I don't mind not having a ceremony. Ready. I won't lose. Mm. Reporting to today. What the hell, Roy? What are you, an isekai protagonist? run off to sheesh I was just getting warmed up this is the best part tongue-tied well you know there you are oh, hello Roy and hello to you as well uncle you look radiant in your in that outfit Lolina I couldn't be more proud and I'm sure Hector feels the same way well uncle please at this rate I'll be too embarrassed to ask ask what well, if I win, will you or... Actually, we should focus on the upcoming battle. Just forget I said anything, okay? Ready. Over here, oh, come on. Are you serious? It's that cliche? Come on. Just fucking say it! <laughs> We're going to search for that bouquet over there. But let's talk later, Roy. Oh, uh, right. Hmm, what's got into her lately? I hope everything is all right. I am no chatterbox. But I couldn't, can't find the bouquet. Much less tell Roy how I really feel. This is not how I hoped today would go. It's too early to give up, Lilina. Focus on what you can do, and rest will come naturally. Yeah, we have a 
been knocked out of the tournament yet, so just you wait. Lord Roy, do my best. Seems the ladies are ready to ready and ready to go. It wouldn't do us for us to fall behind now, would it, Roy? Right, father, I'll give it my all. Ready. I won't wait over here. Mm. Reporting for duty. There we go. We're on the paralog, yay! Roy managed to clinch the win, and even found a, found the bouquet. Now what am I supposed to do? Why so glum? We, we haven't heard who he's gonna choose. I can make a guess to your preferred outcome, but only Roy knows his exact intentions. As hard as this may be for you to hear, you should prepare yourself if you choose someone else. Yes, Roy. Oh, there he is now, with Uncle in tow. Congratulations on your victory, Roy. Have you thought about who to invite to the ceremony? To be honest, I would rather let that honor be yours, Father. Please take the bouquet. Wait, what? I intend I intend for you to have it from the beginning. My victory means a ceremony for you and Mother. I thought since we're all here together, what better time to reaffirm your vows? That's very thoughtful of you, but are you absolutely sure? I know how hard you worked for this. Of course, after all, I'm only here today because you and Mother once came together like this. This is a gift from a child to his parents. Well, let's go and su surprise Mother with the good news. Very well. I can't say that I saw this coming, but I would never refuse such an earnest request. Roy really does care for his family, huh? Just one of the many reasons why I... Oh my, your face is red as an apple. Is that what they mean by a blushing bride, huh? Please, C Celia, this is serious. Yes, of course, with so many girls at the Roy's affections, suppose you have your hands full. You're right, I have a long road ahead of me, but I know where it leads. I will become the woman eminently qualified to stand side to side with the future Mar Marquess. In doing so, I will follow the path that our fathers in Ostia and Fera blazed for our generation. Even if we... If I don't reach my desired destination, the journey will have been, still been worth well, well worth it. Wise words, Lelina. You know, I may have, I may have to take a more proactive approach. Not sure I follow. I imagine the ceremony is starting soon. Come, we must see what his mother chooses to wear. Oh right. Hmm. Interesting. Well, see you guys in the next paralogue. Bye.